Okay, you might have heard about the Game Topper that's on Kickstarter right now. I was able to buy for myself, thank you, Kevin, a uh, early copy. I picked this up at Gen Con. I'll talk more about that later, but uh, I wanted to kind of give you an overview of the main things that you can expect, the game mat, the table, the, the card slot, the accessories, all that kind of stuff. So take a look at that, and then at the end I'll talk probably for too long. So here we go. So the game... Or the accessories, they've got this rail where you can slide stuff anywhere. Uh, so whatever you want to do, it just kind of pops in there. It's, it's real strong. I mean, I'm afraid to lean on it because I don't want to break it, but it feels, feels crazy strong. Um, this is the double one, uh, the double cup holder. That seemed a lot harder than it normally is, but um, you got the double cup holder or the single one. Um, which is pretty nice, um, and drink or components can sit on top of it or whatever you want to do. So I really like it. My only complaint is this center spot here that I can't put something in the middle here, but the fact that I can go all the way up to it or all the way down is pretty nice. Um, this is that piece that holds everything together. You, you line up your pieces and then you put this on, so it's really easy to set it up and take it apart, so now this will come apart, and then when I'm ready to lock it down, it goes in place. Um, so that's pretty nice, really easy, not complicated. Um, so there you go. So I also wanted to show you this card rail that they put in, where you can put cards or tokens. These are actually thick cardboard, like Carcassonne. This is lanterns. But um, this, uh, these lantern tokens actually sit in there perfectly and hold up and so that's kind of a nice feature this just goes around the whole edge of the table the the game mat that comes with it and I think there's different styles or whatever but this game mat is just normal mouse pad neoprene whatever you call that but then uh, it lays down in here and is nice that I can change this out I'm gonna get the board game closet one it'll be awesome but and even just the met or the wood that's in here is really nice even without it I remember when I got it, this out of the box I was like crazy impressed just by the look of this itself is really nice and then you can add interchangeable mats to it that is pretty epic Okay, so Game Toppers is on Kickstarter right now, and if you haven't heard about it, it is a piece, I can't, I don't know if you can tell, but it is actually a, a game top that you put on, a, on an existing table. And I've had a number of people ask me about it in our reviews, and so I thought I'd do kind of a, a rundown of what you can expect if you back this on Kickstarter. Um, Kevin didn't ask me to do this. I don't even know if he wants me to do this, but um, I just thought that I would give you kind of an overview of why I like it so much. I did buy this table. I got it from him. I think he threw in a couple extra of these cup holders for me, but I did actually buy this table. I wasn't given it, so don't expect... Uh, my review to be biased in any way. I paid cash money for this, and uh, so you're getting an actual review of somebody who bought it and uh, is enjoying the table right now. So high points are that it feels sturdy. It doesn't feel like it's sitting on top of my table. It actually feels like it is my table, which I think is really huge. There's no worries about it leaning over, toppling over, not once during all the all the time that we played, and I played on this since Gen Con, not once during any of my reviews has, has it even felt like it wasn't a table. It's felt like my table. And, uh, and to be totally honest, I already had a table that I liked. I found this table with these cool chairs. I got it used uh, at like a yard sale type thing. And so for me, um, I didn't know if I necessarily needed this, but I got it and it upgraded what I already had, which is weird. Um, I didn't know how I would feel about the inlay. You know, a lot of people aren't, you know, don't know what they think about that, that it actually goes down, but I love it because it keeps everything on the table. Dice aren't going to roll off. Pieces aren't going to roll off. And um, these, these added... Um, drink holders, I think what they were called, is that a drink holders, I didn't really know if I was going to need them or use them because I've always, I've never had them, I guess. I've always just set drinks on the table, stuff like that. But the fact that it gets it off the table extends the amount of space that I have on the table. Now it's not, a drink isn't hogging this whole corner of the table now. Now it's got its own place. And with the cork top thing on it, now I can hold components off the table as well. And you have plenty of space. This is the 38 
eight by sixty, and I still have plenty of space. Like all the way, this is the new Champions of Midgard mat uh, with the expansion, so it's huge, the biggest play mat that I have, and I still have probably ten inches all the way around where everybody can sit around and play this game. And so the size is great, sturdy, it's great. The wood, aluminum feel, this thing is not going anywhere. It's crazy strong, but yet it feels uh, like a piece of furniture and not like, uh, you know, just this metal thing sitting on top of my table. I couldn't recommend it enough. It is an added upgrade that I'm so glad that I've got. Uh, not just because of how nice it feels here, but uh, we've got a local gaming event coming up, uh, NEA Game Fest, yay. And, um, and I'm thinking about taking it to that. The fact that I can break this down, put it in my wife's SUV and drive it across town and set this up uh, at a gaming event across town, I couldn't do that if this was a massive table with legs and pieces and all of that. But I can take this top off Take it down to that gaming event, and now I've got something that I'll be proud of there, which is my ultimate compliment on this table, is when people come over, I'm proud of it. I'm not having to explain away some things where maybe they skipped or it's cheesy or that's, you know, cheap, and yeah, I'm kind of disappointed in that. No, when people come over, I'm proud of this thing because everything about it I like. The fact that I can change out the game mat, and one day we're going to have a board game closet <laughs> uh, mat down here. Uh, I just love it. I'm really proud of it, and I'm glad that I got it. So anyways, I'll stop talking. Go check it out if you're interested. Game Top. LLC.